this is Nitpicks Gaming again. Today we're going to be trying to get some of these bee nests and make a beehive maybe, get some honeycomb and some bottles of honey, maybe make a honey block or two, breed some bees, just start our own little bee farm, see what we can do with that. So, first thing I'm gonna do Actually, I'm gonna see. Oh, that's weird how that's laying on there. I don't know if I can tell if there's any bees in there, but it looks like there's honey. So. So we got that. I think I should have just got the honeycomb now. I have to wait for that to fill up again. But I have a little bottle of honey there. Honey bottle, isn't that cute? Oh, there he is. Is he gonna go back in? I can't tell how many's in there. Um, honey level one. So we have to wait till he gets some honey. I don't wanna take his nest sun's starting to go down. I don't know if that makes a difference. Oh, he's getting some pollen off that daisy, so maybe we'll be able to get that in a minute. Maybe I'll break this. Should have got an axe. See how that looks. I think there's some other honeycomb behind our house, too, so we'll let him go back in. Take that. There's at least one bee in there. I'll have to keep an eye out see if there's any more bees that come around. I'm just going to go ahead and stick this in the chest that's out by the stable. I don't know where I'm going to build our little honeybee farm. Put that there for now. Sun's starting to go down. I think I'm gonna go back over here see if there's any more bees. I need at least one more bee. I guess there was only one bee there. I think there was a flower forest somewhere around here. Let's just loop up around the back of the house, see if there's any bee nests. I did a bunch of, bunch of tree harvesting earlier. Uh, let's see if there's any bee nests back here. I thought I saw one, but it's been a while. See this warped, warped nether wart or whatever this is? What is this? Warped roots. I think a uh, enderman from the nether followed me through the portal and plopped that there. It looks so funny to see it in the overworld. Mm. Oh, there is one. Ooh. Well, I'm pretty sure there's at least one bee in there. I thought I saw one hop in there quick. So we're going to go home with those two bee nests and see if we can make us some little house or structure that they'll be all right in for now. So we're gonna do that. I haven't done much with bees and this was, they were updated, put in a few, a couple of updates ago. I just never really figured out what I wanted to do with them. But I figured in here now, I'll just get a chance to play around with them, see how it goes. Oh shoot, my other beehive's out there. I'll just put this one out there with the honey bottle. Might as well keep everything together. When I make the little bee farm, I'll just leave a chest out there. Two beehives. Bee nest, whatever. I think the honey bottles are stackable at least, so that's good. So I have to figure out how I want to build 
think we're going to try some brick again. Do the bottom part in brick. I'm going to have it mostly made out of glass, though. Hmm. Take some of these. I think I'm going to need a lot of logs. I think I'm going to make it mostly out of glass. I did start burning or smelting some, so we should have plenty to work with. But I think I want some brick too. I don't know if we'll need more than that or not. We have plenty to work with if we need more. Alright, let's find a place to build this. Hmm. Where do I want to put our bee farm? I don't think it needs to be huge. Maybe we can kind of put it up here in the corner. We'll open up this part of the fence. I don't know why I like having all my structures kind of going through the fence. I just do. I took spruce for fencing purposes. Well, I'd probably still use it. I don't have to use the dark oak all the time. I have an idea of what I want to do here. fairly big. I want the bees to have plenty of room to move around. One, two, three, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I can't count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Take one away. I think I want to make a double door to get in here. That's why I'm being ridiculous about counting. Oops. Alright, I'm not going to be keeping corner bits. So I'll show you that in a bit. Let's get rid of some of this grass. These are the really tall pieces. This is where we'll have the front doors here, I think. Um, I think I'll just put cobble down. We don't use that too often. There. Now we need to get some glass. gonna kind of look like a greenhouse I think or a really funky looking aquarium oops
So this is our little bee farm. It's not an automatic one or automated one in any way, shape, or form. But uh, we have a couple of bee nests in there. I put some flowers in there. I have it mostly made out of glass so I can see through it and have the bees see through it. But I put some of those wooden fencing up. I thought it would be nice and decorative. It is kind of weird looking. But just having it all be glass, I didn't really like either. Oh, there's a bee in there now. So I'm going to go in there and try and see if we can't get some honeycomb out of the one that's dripping honey. And also maybe see if we can breed some. And hopefully not let any out. He seems to like the flowers. Oh, he went back in there. There's supposed to be a bee in this one, I hope. Hope he is. Oh, that's not the right spot. There. Put that there. Try and shear. Yay, I did it! Oh, there is a bee there. I don't want them to sting me because that kills them. You know, like regular bees. Alright, let's see if we can get them to breed. Stop flying around, dude. Alright, let's make a baby bee! <gasps> Too cute! Look at that! Look how tiny he is! Noise. He is so cute. Alright, I don't remember how many bees are allowed to be in one bee nest at the moment, but we have three honeycomb, which will let us make a bee hive, I believe. I think. It's kind of like making a bookcase. You round it with wood. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Perfect. Okay, well, we'll hang on that till the morning. Go ahead and go to bed. I need to put some lighting in that beehive. I keep forgetting about it. I'm going to try and put some glowstone in the ground and cover it with some leaves. See how that looks. Or shroom lights. Probably glowstone because I have plenty. At least I think I have plenty of. Yeah, plenty of glowstone. Okay, I do have some leaves. I'm going to move the campfire for now. I still got to decorate these houses. Maybe I'll do that next episode. Yeah, we've got this guy. Gunpowder, brown dye. So nothing good from him. Let's try... See if this brightens things up. I think that makes it look nice. Let's see if any label. Nope, can't have any babies yet. I'm gonna put some of these pink ones down. Aren't you, buddy? There. Do you like the pink ones? Now, I don't know how long it takes for them to make. But we're going to need to put... Does this attach on the top like those do? I don't know if they do or not. Let's try it. Oh, this messes with my eyeballs. Yep. Okay. All right, well, we're gonna have to be patient and just, it looks like the, <gasps> wait a minute, there was another one in there. Wow. Well, I think we're still gonna have to wait because two of them aren't ready to breed. They are so cute. There must've been an extra bee in one. Okay, so in this chest, I'm gonna store my bottles and, ooh, I'm gonna go get my honey bottle from over here. We'll collect up the honey bottles. Um, 
I believe you can drink the honey, but I don't really know how much hunger it gives back or if it lasts very long. But um, you can make honey blocks from it. I know you can make honeycomb blocks out of honeycomb, but I don't think I don't think honeycomb blocks really do anything, so I don't know if I'm really going to worry about making them. I should always have some extra flowers in there. Maybe I'll go pick some more flowers so I can stick them in the chest to have to feed the bees to breed them. That might be a good idea. I want to decorate this area too. It's cute inside with all the flowers, but around here I think I'm going to want to put some leaves to look like shrubbery. Maybe get some vines? Oh, that would be cool. Alright, well maybe we'll go on a mission. We'll fly around and get some. See if we can find some more flowers. Oh, even still, there's plenty of flowers on the ground. We can just stop and pick some up. Uh, I think the. Well, I thought there's a flower forest around here somewhere, but there's plenty of flowers in general, so. Can't be too picky. Let's get some of these daisies. I don't have any daisies yet. some daisies, get some poppies. Yeah, if we would have had an iron farm, we'd have plenty of poppies. But, I don't want to deal with that. We might just need to bone meal the grass once in a while and get some more flowers to grow. When we need more. I don't think we're going to need to breed a ton of bees. We just need enough. I want to make a couple, maybe two more beehives. And then that should be plenty. And we'll need, I think, I'm not 100% sure, but I think two to three bees fit in each hive. But I could be wrong. I have really no idea. And you know what? I think we need to... We got a new horse last episode. Nice gray horse with lots of hearts compared to pudding. And I'm going to name him. I've got an idea for his name. see if any oh yay let's get some honeycomb there we go all right I probably didn't need this many campfires but oh well You gotta make sure you pick up your campfires with silk touch to make sure they don't break apart or you're gonna be making campfires all over the place. All right, I'm just waiting for more of your buddies to come out to see if we can breed you guys. See if it's been long enough. Two more hives. Bee farm, bee hut, I don't know what you call it. Alright, that should be plenty. Let's go to sleep and see if the bees will come out in the morning. Oh, yep, they are out. Yay! See if we can breed some bees. Here. Yay. Oh. There. Make a baby. Oh, they didn't want to make a baby. Oh, they did make a baby. Cool. 
Okay. We'll just have to see. We'll have to keep breeding bees and see if we um, can get any to go into the man-made hives. So. That'll be time consuming. So let's see if we can find a name tag right now. And we'll go ahead and we'll name our new horse. Um, yeah, I knew I got some more name tags while I was fishing. So we are going to name, I'm going to name him since he's gray and he's wearing iron horse armor. We're gonna call him Ironsides. 10 points to anybody who knows where I got the name Ironsides. It's a historical thing. I still want to try and find more horses. I think I'm going to try my hand at breeding just to see how that goes. Ironsides! Isn't he cute? I think she's a little bit of red on the blanket underneath the saddle. Where are you, dude? See? Cute. And here's Pudding, his fancy diamond armor. Now I do have more diamond armor, I just thought the silver, the iron, looked really cool on him, so. I don't have any gold horse armor, I don't think. Because our next horse maybe should wear gold, so then we have one of each. Can you make gold horse armor? I don't think you can. Can you? I don't know if that would be on here. Let me see if it comes up. You can make leather horse armor. I don't know if I'd want to bother with leather, but it would be cool looking. Let me grab some gold here just to see if it comes up. Nope. You can just make leather. Interesting. Oh, I'm going to put these extra flowers in the gold bars. In with the bees. And hopefully we can come back and try and breed them again. Oops. And we'll put in campfires. So they're always here. Okay. Well, let's go out. We're going to go get some more leaves. I don't think we need to fly. We can just go over here. Get some more leaves for decorating. See if we can put some leaves on the outside of that. Our farm. Our bee farm. For decorative purposes. <gasps> That's a cool noise. It's freaking awesome. It really goes through the shears really quick though. Not ready to break. Yep, they broke. Good enough. Collect some honey. What is up with you, Ironsides, buddy? He's all not liking his stall, I don't think. I don't know how much time it takes for the bees to get to the point where they're ready to breed again. The beehives are full of honey again already. Come on, go in the man-made hives. Alright, let's try and decorate this a little bit. That looks kind of neat. Now I gotta make sure if I'm decorating this side, it's not gonna make it so that something can climb. Climb up and over. Should be good. Yeah, I don't want to try too hard here and have something spawn and come over. Might be pushing our luck as it is. I may need to put some glowstone in the ceiling of that glass so nothing spawns on the roof of that. Maybe I should put something over this way. Like that. 
I think it looks cool. Let's put some over here while we got it. I like that corner. I think that looks cool. Have to get some flower pots and flowers to plant. Right? Yeah. It's a good start. I mean, I need more, but it's a good start. I think that's it for this episode. Uh, thanks for hanging out with me. If you enjoyed this episode, if you had some fun, if you learned something, um, please leave a like. Consider subscribing. Next episode, we're going to do some more with the bees. Try and get some more... Uh, bees to go into the man-made hives and see if we can do something with some honey blocks maybe find another horse look more into horse breeding there's a lot of things if there's anything you'd like to see please comment below and thanks for watching